I got involved in long-term care. Um, my mother worked for a facility, a long-term care facility. She worked in the office and the residents would come into the office quite frequently and I would talk to them and they'd ask me questions about school and what I was doing and I this one particular gentleman Mr. Hall he would every time I came to visit he would come up in the front to see me and he and I kind of formed a relationship and I would go in just to visit him I mean my mother worked there but I would go to visit him most of the time we formed this relationship and I remember he got really sick and I would go in more frequently to see him and I was with him when he passed away and that just really changed my view on elders in long-term care facilities and I wanted to take care of them. I decided to go get my SENA license because I really wanted to be an aide. It was something that I thought I could, you know, provide a lot of good care and I you know, thought, oh, I'm a caring person, I can do this. I eventually ended up working at Sanctuary at the Park. My mother recommended me to come to Trinity, so I applied here. When I, while I was working as a SENA, I had always thought about nursing in the back of my mind, and I started taking prerequisites for the nursing program while working as a nurse's aide. And I just kind of, as I worked, I just kept taking classes towards the nursing program and once I got accepted I still worked part-time when I could while I wasn't in classes and eventually got my LPN license and they hired me here as an LPN. I feel that senior care is something I really like because I like the atmosphere, I like how it's a home feel, it's not like a hospital where you know you have your white walls and you have all these alarms. It's more of a home and you build a closer relationship with the people that you take care of and they kind of become a member of your family. The resident that I took care of that had Alzheimer's, I cared for him almost every day that I worked. I was always in the same section and I'd go in and introduce myself to him every day and I never thought that he remembered who I was or could understand even what I was telling him, but kind of one day out of the blue, I I went in and he says, oh, hey, you're Lisa, aren't you? And it just kind of shocked me because I didn't think that he even knew who I was. And just knowing that every time that I went in and said my name, that he just remembered it just the one time and that really touched me.